Hey, what's up, everyone? It's uh, Jonathan here, Bay Area Throwbacks. Uh, today, I'm just going to be showing my autographed photos that I have. Um, I don't have as many as a lot of other people. I don't have a huge amount. I used to have more, but uh, I sold a couple of them. Um, I used to have a Joe Montana signed picture, a Jerry Rice signed picture, and I, both of those I sold. I think I've sold some other ones, too, through the time. But um, for right now, I'm just going to show what I do have. Uh Pretty much, that's pretty much this. We'll just get started. So first here, I got a Vita Blue autographed Oakland A's photo. Um, so Vita Blue was a, a one of the good, best pitchers in the 70s, 80s, big time pitcher. Um, pitched for the A's. It's probably he's most known for the A's, but he also did pitch on the Giants too. Um, something else about him is on his the back of his jersey, he used to have, it used to say Vita. So it said it's his first name and not his last name. So if you thought Ichiro was the first to do that, um, Vita Blue. I'm not saying Vita Blue was the first to do it, but he also did it back then. So he was doing that too. So that's uh, Vita Blue. My Actually, my aunt, about a story about this, my aunt was in a restaurant somewhere. I think it was in San Francisco. I don't, I don't know for sure, but she was at a restaurant and he was just there signing autographs. So she got him to, she got his autograph. So that's Vita Blue right there. Uh, another one I got, I got a Roger Craig autograph photo. Uh, one of the best running backs in 49ers history. Um, I've already done a, a video on the jersey of his that I have. So I already kind of stated a lot of stuff there. But uh, like I said, one of only three players ever to have a uh, 1,000 yards rushing and a 1,000 yards receiving in one season. He was the first one to ever do it. And then, like I said, Marshall Fogg did it as well in 99 and Christian McCaffrey in 2019. So he's one of three players and he was the first to do that. So legendary Roger Craig. If you wanna know more about Roger Craig, you can uh, look him, uh, I have the video. I'll put the link in the description of the video I have of him, his jersey that I posted. Uh, so next we have Jeremy Newberry. Um, he was a center for the 49ers for a good part of the 2000s. Uh, he was one of the really good centers in the league. He stuck around for a while. So he had that number 62. So that's a Jeremy Newberry autographed picture. Uh, next, I got a Nick Swisher, uh, one of my friends, Nick. His name's actually Nick, too, my friend. He, um, I think he went to a, a card show or something at the Great Mall in Milpitas. And... Uh, he got a few of these, and he gave one to me and one of my brother. So I got a Nick Swisher. Good player, switch hitter, switch hitting outfielder. Played for the A's for a while. Also played on the Yankees. I think the Indians, too. I know for sure the Indians. I don't know who else he played for, but he was a good player for the A's outfielder. Nick Swisher. So next, I have uh, Lance Schultz's. What is it? I had a quick interruption. So uh, Lance Schultz was a defensive back for 49ers from 1998 to 2001. Uh, he played with some other teams after that. But, yeah, so he was a defensive back for them. Lance Schultz, number 30. And uh, with this one, I actually have the Certificate of Authenticity. Let me take that out. So if you see right here, Letter of Authenticity. Uh, here, I certified that the photo which accompanies this document has been uh, personally hand-signed by Lance Schultz. By Tones Memorabilia with the 408 number. So I got Lance Schultz's right here. So I got that. And my last one that I have, that I can find at least. This is a, it's not a Bay Area player, but uh, it has to do with Bay Area sports. So I have a Mark Pryor autograph photo. Um, what's crazy is, um, when Dusty Baker was the went to become the manager of the Cubs, I remember there was a game where uh, Pryor hit Bonds, and Bonds, as you can see there, actually charged the mound um, and charged Mark Pryor. Um, and this is when Dusty Baker, after that she was the manager of the Giants, he was the manager of the Cubs now. So that was a little thing. That, that was I don't think there was, there was no punches thrown or anything, but he did kind of come out. I don't know if that's Todd Hundley or who that is. I know he was one of the catchers back then, I'm pretty sure, for the Cubs. If I'm not mistaken, but um, I don't know exactly who the catcher is, but we got Mark Pryor, who at the time was one of the best uh, up and coming pitchers in the league. Um, injuries kind of messed his career up. And then obviously you got one of the best hitters of all time. It's number one home run hitter right here. Um, 
Barry Bonds. So uh, this lady who used to work for my dad, actually her son played at USC with Mark Pryor. So we had a couple, a few, a lot of things autographed by Mark Pryor, actually. I have a picture, too, when I was a kid with Mark Pryor. I remember I had a Giants hat on. He was in town in San Francisco to play the Giants. So I put my Giants hat on backwards to take the picture with him. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, but this one I thought was the coolest one because we got this picture, and he he was cool enough to sign it. So, yeah, so that was that's my Mark Pryor. I always said if I could get Bonds to sign this and then figure out who the catcher was and have him sign it, this would be really cool. But I don't know how realistic that is. But, yeah, so that's my Mark Pryor autographed. Barry Bonds charge in the mound photo. So that's all I really got. I don't like I said I don't have a bunch of I have, I have more I have some autograph at home at my parents' house. I gotta look. I have autograph baseballs. Um I have a good amount of autograph baseballs. I have autograph baseball cards. So I just need to find where all those are. Hopefully I can find them one day. And uh I mean I think my parents know where they're at. I just gotta look for them and then I can show those ones off too. But uh so, yes, yeah, so those are my autograph photos that I have of Bay Area players plus Mark Pryor. But yeah, so besides that, you just like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, thanks for checking in. Uh, that's pretty much it. So, everyone have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time.